Right, thoughts on white homelessness or white homeless? Yeah, you're going to have to kind of expand on that. I mean, they're homeless because they made bad decision after bad decision. It doesn't matter if they're white, black, purple or blue. They're homeless because they made bad decision after bad decision. All of them homeless people, apart from the ones that have mental issues, if you look through their timeline, at some point they fucked up. And these people that talk about, oh, you're letting all the foreigners come over here when we got our own English people here sleeping on the streets and that. Blood, you, they need to ask themselves, why are they homeless? You know, you don't just wake up one day and you're homeless. You've, you've made some bad decisions in that. How do you not have no friends and family that want to take you in? You have to really deep it. Why don't you have any friends and family that don't want to take you in? Like, why doesn't your mum, why doesn't your dad, why doesn't your brother, why doesn't your sister, auntie, uncle, cousin, friends, how can everybody that you know in your human existence, how can nobody want to take you on? Yeah? Obviously, if I became homeless, you know no one would take me in and that. Like, ah, well, where's them properties now and that, innit? Because you know that like, people are haters and that. Innit? So you can understand why no one wanted to take me into their house. Yeah? But most people are not like me. Most people are just cool. They don't say or give their opinion. They don't hurt people's feelings and that. Why is the normal person or an average person, how can you not have nobody that wants to take you in? How can your mum not want you to even sleep on her living room floor, let alone her sofa? What about your dad, uncle, auntie, grandma, friends, cousin, no girlfriend, nobody? Yeah, yeah. Are you that much of a bad person that your family and friends would rather know that you're sleeping on the streets rather than give you a roof over your head for a week, two weeks, a month, just so you can try and figure things out? They're probably an alcoholic. Yeah. That, you're going to have problems if you have a fucking alcoholic or a junk in your house, obviously. But we're going to steal your food out of your fridge. You come home and the jacket potatoes are missing in that. Oh, blood clot, blood.